Yeah, what's going on, y'all? With well, all the controversy that's going on right now over a song, a lot of people are really hurt, 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 hurt in their feelings. Hey, thank you for coming to my channel. My name is Wally, and you are now tuning into Playboy Hustlers TV. Hey, this is King of Melodies B. Yeah, man, so back to what I was saying, man. You already know your man Jason Aldean's song, Try That in a Small Town, got a lot of people shaking in the ground. You understand what I mean? I don't see anything wrong with the song. I feel like what he's promoting is like holding your own down, and there's nothing wrong with that. You understand what I'm saying? You know, in the big cities, people are too occupied, preoccupied with a lot of nothing. So unfortunately, they're unable to you know, unite and stand together. They're all divided. But listen, you cannot try any of that in a small town. Ain't no riders going to make it out. You can't even make it in. How about that? And listen, that's how, like I'm saying, that's how it should be all around across the board. You got to understand something like this, right, man? Opinions are like buttholes. Everybody has one, but it doesn't make it a fact. You understand what I mean? Yeah, man. So sometimes you got to be careful when the media is trying to make you think a certain way. You got to step back, think critically. And use rational. You understand what I mean? Because if not, man, I'm telling you, if you think with your feelings and your emotions, they got you by the balls. I'm sorry, baby. That's just how life goes. You got to snap out of that. And you got to think with this right here, not with this. Because this will fool you. You understand? This goes with feelings. And every day you're going to feel different. With that being said, thank you for all the love and support I have been getting. It is not going unnoticed. Let me go ahead and press play. Let's see what Joe Rogan about to say about this. You can do that with the, like, that's probably going to happen with some other stuff, too. Like, people are upset at the Country Music Channel. You know, oh, because they, yeah, yeah. The Jason Aldean yeah, song, Jason Aldean Try song. That in a Small yeah. Town. Yeah. The level of outrage. Like, now, I'm not saying that that's the greatest song the world's ever known, you know? But the level of outrage. But I'm not going to front. That song is fire, yo. I ain't going to front. I can listen to that song. The energy that song gives me is not hatred. It's more so like I'm amped up to just like save the world. <laughs> Coming from people that are upset about that song is so strange. When there are hundreds of rap songs out there yeah. that are infinitely worse and also enjoyable. Misogynistic, and, uh, yeah, uh -huh. prolifying mm -hmm. violence. The and I know what a lot of people's going to say. Oh, why is he saying the rap music instead of? You know, the country music. Basically, what he's trying to say is this, right? In rap music, they allow you to say that you're going to end someone. You understand what I'm saying? They allow you to degrade each other, devalue. They allow you to devalue each other, say the harshest things. And it's promoted. You got Nike, you got money on it, uh, all the big companies, you know? But as soon as Jason out. Dean try to reunite people, you know, they're going to sit here and say, oh, look where he's doing the video at, the historic blah, 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 blah. Look, listen, all these streets got something historic in it. And by the way, they've shot numerous scenes there for Disney, Miley Cyrus. Nobody said anything then. So this is why I'm telling you, you got to think critically. Don't allow them to tell you how to think. All right. Oh, yeah. Thing, yeah. And no, no complaints at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. And we're not even talking about old stuff. There's new stuff too. There's 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 hip hop. There's wild rock songs. There's a lot of wild shit, and to be focusing on that one, and it it's the racial aspect of it, it was crazy because like the real Antifa problems that were happening during the BLM, I think it was a lot of white people doing that, right. wasn't it? It was yeah. a lot of like yeah. lost liberal whites who are very angry who decided to take up this movement and smash things. So, like, the racial aspect of it, there's nothing racial about the lyrics. Or how about the Tracy Alt? Did you see the Tracy Allman uh, controversy? No, I did not. So she, she wrote in the, I don't know if you remember, in, I think it was 1988, she had this like, iconic song, Fast Car. Yes. Uh, oh, right, 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 right. And then this. Let me know in the chat if you heard about the song he's talking about, all right? So uh, I guess he's a country music Tracy singer. Tracy Chapman. Yeah. Chapman. Did I yeah. say Ullman? Oh, that's, she's yeah. an actress, right? She's a comedian. Tracy yes. Ullman. Tracy Chapman. Thank Chapman. you. Chapman, yeah. And then this this uh, singer asked for her permission, I guess, to, yeah. to, to, do, Combs. to do a cover and so on. It's amazing. And, and then people came out that, you know, the white guy is usurping the... St 
Well, yeah. Well, you, but that's always going to happen. Yeah. You're always going to have a certain amount of people to say that. Yeah. It doesn't mean it's real. Right. It's it also, and apparently she's happy that he's doing it. Well, no kidding. So I mean, everybody's good, and it's a great song. I mean, it's it really is. good. As he he didn't even change the gender, like when he sang it. Yeah, yeah. You know. Yeah. I can become a checkout girl. He says checkout girl. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 